Hi guys, Animal Ambassador Clay here with Bataka, a black and white rough lemur. You know, October 4th is right around the corner, and that's our annual run for the fun, a benefit to our nonprofit SeaWorld Bush Gardens Conservation Fund. Now, since 2003, the Conservation Fund has granted money to projects in over 60 different countries worldwide, helping animals just like lemurs. Now, these animals are facing some environmental issues, one of them being habitat loss. But let's find out some ways that we can help these creatures and, and let's get some perspective on how fast their habitat is actually disappearing. Now lemurs come from the island of Madagascar and that island is being devastated by deforestation. You know what, instead of telling you, I need to show you. But if only I had a pizza. Right. Oh, thanks. All right, here we go. Now, this pizza has been cut into 10 slices. And I want you to imagine that this is Madagascar. Of course, Madagascar being so big, Gotta shrink down your imagination. But the lemurs only have 10% to live on. So that's like me getting rid of this one, 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 this one, this one, this one, and this one. And being left with only this one slice of pizza. Now the habitat in Madagascar isn't in one solid slice. So for this, I'm gonna need my handy karate chop action. Okay, there it is. This is the existing habitat in Madagascar. Now it's spread out all over the island. Now this habitat is not only shared by over 60 different species of lemur, that habitat is for the fusa, chameleons, tortoises, birds, all these animals sharing tiny pieces of environment for themselves. So how can you help? Well, it's very simple. You can reduce, reuse, and recycle. You can also, if you're buying new furniture, try to stay away from any furniture made from exotic wood. Now our Sea Bush Gardens Conservation Fund is sponsoring a project right now in Madagascar to help rebuild those forests. But the lemurs are doing their part too. And you wouldn't believe it, they're doing their part with poo. Come on. Lemurs are fruitivores, so they eat a piece of fruit, they digest the fruit, but not the seeds. And while they sit high in the treetops, those fruit seeds fall to the forest floor. Take a look at this. This is lemur poop, and it's full of fruit chunks. Now, a lot of times, those chunks also include fruit seeds. And other little animals, like these Madagascar hissing cockroaches, will come along. They'll decompose the stuff around the seeds and fertilize a brand new fruit tree. Tree grows up, bears fruit, lemurs eat the fruit, they poop the seeds down, roaches do their job, another tree grows. Well, you get the idea. But in Madagascar, this cycle is being affected because there's less trees, which means there's less fruit, which means there's less poop, which means there's less new trees being grown, which means there's less lemur. So as you can see, coming to Run for the Fun on October 4th benefits animals just like Bataka here and all the other creatures of Madagascar. So remember, to register for our Run for the Fun, go to SeaWorld.com. Get your workout going. Get ready, because animals all over the world will benefit from your run that morning. Animals in over 60 different countries. Thank you so much. For now, Animal Ambassador Clay signing off. See you later.